All right, got diesel DC number one all masked up for the paint. I already shook the paint a little bit, but I'll go ahead and shake it up a little bit more. See, this is the actual color name. All right, now let's go ahead and test it. I've had issues with the paint before. Uh-oh, the masking I'm having issues with. See, this tape does not stay on long at all. So we're going to have to hurry up and get this done. Let me just go ahead and do a test real quick. All right, it looks like it's not... Right now. There. Now I think it'll work. One more test. Okay. I think it's good to paint now. We will zoom in and commence to painting with a pink. Well, this, I'm going to have to use my thumb again, so let's just see if this masking tape holds down. Here we go. One, a uh, couple more passes. Oh, it's clogging up. All right, I'm going to have to pause the tape while I unclog this. All right, we are now unclogged. Let's do another pass. This paint just plugs up. All right, one more pass. I'll turn it around. This time I did the masking right, so I don't think I have to worry about ruining uh, let me adjust that, ruining the bottom. I'm going to adjust that masking a little bit. Here we go. <clears throat> ah, why did you plug it up? There. Probably two or three more passes. And one more pass. I'll do one more. All right, let me turn it around and check the other side real quick. The pink is the most difficult color. I mean, as far as the paint can be having. All right, let's try one more pass on this side, and I guess it'll be done on this side, and then we'll unmask it. All right. I think Diesel Deuce has got some pink. Diesel Deuce number one's got pink. Let's back off the zoom lens. Take the camera off the tripod. And we'll take it upstairs and remove the masking. Actually, we'll put it on the... Yeah, we'll take it upstairs. All right, here we are up in the kitchen. Some of the masking has already started to come off, so we're just going to peel it off. Ooh, I think that masking went well. And there we have Diesel Lucy number one with the pink. So, that's it for now. All right, there's Diesel Lucy number one all masked up. And guess what? It's time for now. The orange. I hope this is going to work because this, this masking tape is just not cooperating at all. I'm going to have to use my thumb to do some masking down there. So. All right, let's go ahead and zoom in and commence to the orange. Roll up my sleeve a little bit. And here we go. Couple more passes. Now the front. This is going to be kind of tricky. So I got to, I don't know, I'll just mask off this here. I don't know if you're seeing this or not. Let me see. I'm not looking through the camera, of course. But here comes the front. Oop, got my hand. And my stainless steel ring is going to get painted, but I don't really care. All right, and as you can tell, the masking tape is failing. So, I'm going to have to let what I've done dry. 
Look at my hand, it's orange too. And remask. So we'll come back to this in a little bit. Alright, it's remasked now. Let's shake up the paint a little bit more. When I remove the last front mask, I have to get the So we are going to now attempt to finish up the paint on. So here we go. Need to shake it up a little bit more. I hate shaking paint. All right, here we go. Again, cover up the bottom. There, one more, a couple more passes. Yeah, probably got too much on the front. Let me try it one more time. There we go. Now let's do this side right here. Again, I'm. Yeah, I just look through the camera. Here we go. Let me mask that. Alright, now one last pass on the front, and this thing should be done. Except for the radiator. So here we go. Now, look at my hand. <laughs> Let's zoom out. Yes, I got it all over my hand. Take the camera off the tripod. And now let's see if we can remove the masking without damaging. Let's pull it straight off. Actually, I might wait till that dries to remove that masking. Go ahead and yank this off. Here we go. Ah. And there. This is the one that was difficult to remove last time. Let's just pull it straight off. Alright, and those other ones I'll remove later. Now, all that's left to paint is the radiator. So, there's Diesel Ducey number one and orange, pink, yellow, and green. And we'll get another view in just a minute. And there is my hand in beautiful orange. Alright. Here's, I got diesel DC mask, I'm going to hold it in my hand. Here's where I get to do the radiator. Look at this. Oh, the camera's flashing low batteries, probably because it's freezing cold out here. Alright, here we go. Let me go ahead and test. Ooh, I hope it's not getting on him. On the stuff I don't want it on. Alright, a couple more passes. One more pass. And there is the radiator. I hope it focused. I wasn't looking through the camera. Ooh, too much. The paint is cold and it's dripping off. So I am going to peel off the masking tape here in just a minute. And there it is. Look at the radiator. I, I did a little bit too much paint there, so I'm going to let it dry upside down. And now Diesel Ducey's painting is done, and the glow paint will commence soon. All right, here's Diesel Ducey number one. Let's turn some light on here. Oh, there's a picture of Diesel Ducey number one on the T1. Let's turn the light on. Focus. There we go. All right, now that the light is on, let's get a look at Diesel Ducey number one closely. As you can tell, yes, my hand got painted. Look at that. That's weird. The paint is stuck in the hairs on my fingers. Remember that uh, radiator that I thought wasn't too well? The paint actually dried very nicely on it. So, here is Diesel Ducey number one, completely painted. Now the glow paint and clear coat will come next and it can be handled. Let's turn off this light and turn on the black light. And there is Diesel Ducey number one under the black light. Without, with. Okay, that's it for this segment of painting Diesel Ducey number one. Next will come the glow paint and clear coat. 
That's it.